Ladies first. Um, first of all, let me say good evening. It's, um, it's a pleasure and an honor to be here. Um, we're here for a very special man, Mr. Lumba. We're here for a very, very special cause, the Lumba Trust. And uh, I'm a mother of two. I have two kids who are currently up in the room sleeping right now. And um, I heard this most amazing line that said that the only thing that would be harder than raising kids would be if the kids unionize. So <laughs> I know exactly how hard it is to take care of kids. And um, the plight for widow is something, it's, it's unthinkable. It's really, really unthinkable for, uh, for us. It is unthinkable. At the same time, when you think about them doing without the financial means that we have today, it's, it's even more scary. And uh, it's, I, it's something that you would not wish on your worst enemy, literally. Education is something that I, I believe in. I believe in education. I believe that if there is a, a, re, a way to change things, that education is the way to go about it. And the kids, as we say, we, you know, they are the future. And if we need to take care of them, we need to take care of their mothers, as the Deputy Prime Minister very kindly pointed out. And uh, I believe in that. And I hope that all of you all do believe with me that if we need to change the world, we need to change something within us as well. And I hope that that will lead you to writing an even bigger check than what you thought you did, were going to before. Thank you. My wife loves to talk. No, no, I don't mind it. I love it. Uh, but I requested her today, let me speak first, because if she says everything, what, what would I say? And uh, she didn't let me. <laughs> but I remember uh, a short story I had uh, read years ago about a man who wanted to change the world, wanted to be the change. And uh, he tried and grew older and realized that uh, it's very difficult to change the world, so he decided to change, try and be the change for his country. Grew older again and uh, realized that uh, you know he cannot change his country, so he he thought he'd stick to his uh, city and locality. And at the end of the day, when he grew, he was very old. He realized that he should have started with changing himself and people around him. So. I remember the story when I was, uh, when I realized today that it takes only 100 pounds to educate a child for a year. That 100 pounds is a very, very small amount for practically all of us, and, uh, but it is a big change for a child. So you can, you can decide what you want to do and what you can do and how much you can do. There are lots of things on auction today. Lovely things uh, you could buy, but whatever you buy, remember that uh, you're buying a child's education. Thank you.